welcome to home workouts by coach remy this is a beginner friendly workout for if you want to start working out and uh so you you have been inactive for a long time or uh, you are a bit overweight and you want to start your fitness journey this is a beginner friendly workout in this workout we are going to work the whole body and uh, this workout you can do it three to four times per week the things you're going to need for it for this workout you will need a chair two bottles of water and a towel all right this workout will take about 30 minutes if it's your first time on this channel hit the subscribe button and after doing this workout please finish it so that you can you will be able to know if it's a good workout or not but i know it's a very nice workout because the way i've planned it it's so that you can enjoy it hit the subscribe button and share with one or two friends i have tons of workouts for you and uh, more to come on this channel the way we are going to do this workout we will use a heat timer of 20 seconds activity and then we rest 10 seconds stand upright tall let's just doing shallow squat don't go too deep just bending the knees slight bent in the knees then we come up okay next one side step and Raising the arms laterally. Beautiful. Next one, we're going again to this one knee and arms so the finger joint in front beautiful next time we are going to walk
Let's walk. Exaggerate the way you're swinging the arms. Beautiful. We're going again to shallow squat. Like this, slight bend in the knees, back is straight. Let's go. All right, now put the hands here. We're going to do elbow to knee. Make sure you're twisting the upper body. Go as far as your flexibility allows you to. Nice. Now, you see the arm is straight. Do big circle. So it's as if I'm doing windmills with the arms. Beautiful. Next one, we're going to do punch, punch. Let's go. Beautiful. Let's go side to side and uh, we are raising the arms. You have 10 seconds to take a break or uh, if you feel like 10 seconds is not enough sometimes you can push the pause and then wait like one minute. So make sure you finish the workout want to feel the effect or how good this workout is now we're going to do like this so you straighten the arms and you lift the leg as high as you can We're going again to sidestep with swinging the arms. Let's go. Next one. We swing to let's go upward it's as if we are throwing something rest we're going to walk fast, walking fast. Let's go in one, two, let's go. Beautiful. Next one, we're going again to knee. Mm. 
Let's go. Wonderful. We are going to shallow squats. The body is almost warm up, warmed up. Shallow squat, slight bend in the knees. Let's bring our chair. So now we are we have the chair. Need to elbow, go tight, and make sure you have a straight line from ankle to shoulders. Beautiful. Next one. You do kick through. Make sure the legs are spread out. At least shoulder width apart. Go tight. We're going to squats. So you just sit and you stand. Sit and stand. Observe how the back is straight throughout the movement. Uh, I'm trying to push the chest up. Beautiful. We're going again to do the squat. We'll do at least four rounds. Let's go. Two more rounds for the squat. My feet are shoulder width apart and toes slightly facing outward. When I'm going down, the knees follow the orientation of the toes. One more for the squat. Let's go. Okay, so next one you sit down 20 seconds on every side you extend the leg and then you bend it So we look my uh, toes are always facing my uh, the, This bone and the ankle we have a 90 degrees angle So when the leg is straight the toes are looking up not like this make sure all right, now we go on the other leg. So there is always a 90 degree here. So we are just extending the knee joint. I'm lifting the knee from the seat a little bit. The leg. And that activates the hip flexors a little bit. Beautiful. We're going again to the first leg, extending the leg, and then we go to the second leg. Let's go. Beautiful. 
control the, dis the bending of the leg. Okay, we go on the other side. Let's go. Now you come back at the center of the chair and then bend the elbow joint a little bit and then extend the elbow. Don't go too deep. Now we are working the triceps. Beautiful. Now, turn around, and now we are going to be doing kickback. Squeeze the glute when you're kicking up the leg. Squeeze the glute. Beautiful. Now we stand upright and then we bend, put the hands here at the back of the head and then bend, make sure the legs are straight and the back is straight. Beautiful. Let's do one more. This is good for the hamstring and the lower back. Let's go. Now, we are sitting down and we have our bottles, so sit down and take the bottles, we are doing overhead presses. Beautiful. Next one, we are going to do bicep curls, seated bicep curls. Let's go. Beautiful. Now, we come here and then we bring the bottles from the front to the front. So I'm doing a slight rotation during the movement. Here the palms are facing up and here the palms are facing one another. All right. We're going again to, now we are going to hammer curls. Let's go. Seated hammer curls. Beautiful. Next one, we are going to be pushing up like this. So here, the el elbows are bent, and then I'm just pushing up with the bent elbows.
Beautiful. Now let's stand up. We're going to do deadlift. You bend forward and then legs are straight and arms are also hanging loose. Beautiful. Now we stand upright and then we just pull up. We make sure that the the wrist is always below the elbow joint. And retract the shoulders as well. At the top of the movement. Beautiful. Now we're going again to the deadlift. So we come and then Let's go. Now we go to bent over row. So for the you do as if you're going into the deadlift but you stay there. And now we pull upward, core is straight, back is, core is tight, and back is straight. All right, now we pull like this, we let the arms go down, and then we come up. Pull up. Bent over row, it's a combination of the two exercises, bent over row and the deadlift. Beautiful. Now we're going to triceps kickback. We bend forward and then we extend the arms I extend the arms all right next one we do front raise we go to the side, we bring them down, lateral raise to the front, we bring down. Okay, let's go. Now we are going to, each time we do as if we are throwing the bottles we will switch to the other side in the next one this is good for the core the body coordination next one we go to the other side we are throwing Let's go. <laughs> Wonderful. Now we stand upright and then we do bicep curls. Let's go. Beautiful. 
Okay, put the bottles down. Bring the chair. Now we are going to mountain climbers. Go tight. So the knee is touching the forearm. So now we do the right knee to the left arm and uh, on the other side vice versa. Okay, now we bring legs in, we clap, we do this, we clap, let's go. This is the modified bappy. Wonderful. Now we're going again to let's go. Oh, timer is still running. We still have uh, five minutes. Beautiful. Let's go to push up, not too deep. We just go a little bit. Then, if you can do this, then it's okay. You can, if this is too much for you, you can do the previous exercise. Next one. We're going to just kick but from backward. Okay. Let's go on the other side, turn around. So you start from here, you bring it as high as you can. Ah, the knee is soft, it's not, the leg is not straight, straight. Just soft knee. Beautiful. Three minutes to go. Now we go. Yes. We're almost there. And if you have more time, you can repeat the whole circuit. If you have a certain goal, daily goal you have to reach. If your goal is to move, let's say, for one hour. You can redo it. Now we go. Bring the knee as high as your flexibility allows you to. Beautiful. So now we are going to stretch. Each stretch we will hold it for 20 seconds. Now you try to look behind you. Mm. All right. 
right hold the wall and then pull let's stretch the quadriceps Let's go on the other side. Pull as much as you can. Now spread the legs, we will go on one side. This straight, straight, legs are straight. Let's go on the other side. So going to the other side, I turn this leg forward, I turn that leg outward, and then I go to the other side. All right, guys. Thank you for being here with me. Thank you for choosing to spend your time with me. Write something in the comment section. Write something in the comment section. Tell me what you thought about this workout. If it was your first time on this channel, make sure you subscribe to not miss out on more upcoming workouts. If you have any question about workouts or nutrition, you can also type it in the comment section. Thank you and uh, see you in the next workout.